Hello YouTube, Corvette Jim coming to you from the party patio. Got a uh, box opening. Well, not really because it came in an open box. Uh, an online auction house close to my house. Uh, had a listing for five pipes and a pipe stand. Uh, online bidding only so I threw down my high bid of uh, 30 bucks but uh, there's really no description on what the pipes were or are just some pictures and I knew one of them was a shape that I like oh housekeeping smoking my Eric Nording autograph free hand in it champagne drinking some diet Pepsi cherry using my Dagner koozie <clears throat> so I won the bid nobody nobody outbid me and we went and picked them up this morning They're dirty. They're beat up. And when I got back home and started pulling them out of the box and uh, looking at the makers, I think I got a good deal because uh, this dirty boy is a Savinelli. This beat up with chips and chunks missing out of it. Is also a Savinelli. So I was excited because I like Savinelli's. And then I dug a little, you know, pulled another one out. And here we got a tobacco village. Which, uh, after doing a little research, this was made by GBD for the tobacco shops known as Tobacco Village. Very nice pipe, and it, they all need cleaned and restored. Got me this small little K Woody. It's probably the best one in the best shape out of all of them, but it needs stem work. That is some really nasty stems. But the one that got me the most excited is this fine example. This is a Ewan Reese and Company pipe. That's right, the tobacco store in Chicago has a shop pipe. So, over the next few weeks, I'm going to be sending these out to uh, Cane Rod Piper to be restored. And then I will enjoy smoking them. And here is uh, the pipe rack, as you can tell. It needs cleaned and polished. And uh, has a recess here for an ashtray or uh, a tobacco jar. I will try to find a tobacco jar to fit this. So that was my auction find. And until we meet again, keep on smoking.